Planet Hollywood, but it feels a little more like actually Hollywood, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, great. A lot of paparazzi. It's awesome. I live for this stuff. It's a lot of fun. Tell us a little bit about your show at the Flamingo. It's a great show. It's a different show every night. It's seven nights a week. Never take a day off. Um, and we're jamming. Even through the bad economy, we get the lines out the door. It's a lot of fun, but it's a... I guess the best way to explain it, it's a celebrity roast every night, and you're the celebrity. That's the truth. I, I probably talk to half the audience during the show, do a few jokes up front just to earn their trust, and then boom, we nail them. And it's great. But we do it in a nice way, with likability. Sounds like it's something new every night, so you never get bored with it. Exactly. And there's no little midgets swinging on ropes and stuff. None of that. No Cirque stuff. It's just me and the audience. And the interaction is unbelievable. It's a great show. That's fantastic. So tell us what the second best show on the Strip is here, besides yours at the Flamingo. You know what? To be honest with you, every show in Las Vegas is great. If you get a show in Las Vegas, and you know, it, every night there's something going on. That's the beauty part of it. So if you see me on a uh, Saturday, you can go see, you know, uh, Jerry McCambr, Jamak King on Sunday. Or, you know, there's, I mean, there's always something going on, and that's the beauty part of it. But I am one of the guys who does do the seven night thing, so. Monday night, a lot of things are dark, and people, that's why my room's full every Monday, and people come, and there's something to do on Monday. That's the beauty part of Vegas. Any hour, any, any day, there's always something to do. Thank you so much Take care. for talking to us. Oh, of course. Anytime. Bye, guys. Bye.